Well, Portland police right now are cleaning up and kicking out a homeless camp in northwest Portland. Neighbors say it's been an eyesore for months. Brent Weisberg joins us. And Brent, we understand that police have gotten several complaints from business owners out there. Jenny, good afternoon to you. They have. In fact, those complaints have been pretty serious. In fact, some of the business owners around here have said they have found human waste outside their front doorsteps. We've been out here all morning long. Take a look at the sidewalk behind me. You can see it is now clear. People are able to walk down here. I can show you Northwest Savior Street, too. It, too, is clear. Earlier this morning, there were about a dozen homeless people here, including one man and his girlfriend, who say they have been trying to get back on their feet for months now, but life on the street is their only option. We're getting in housing, me and my girlfriend, so that's that's a plus. Uh, it just took longer than we thought. <laughs> Well, Carlos says until they get some housing, they are staying across the street on church property that has allowed them to set up there. The cleanup this morning at Northwest 18th and Northwest Savior happened on property that is owned by ODOT. We first we saw firsthand today the problems that they have been facing. The homeless people were blocking the sidewalk and blocking the area where ODOT trucks park under the interstate. The neighborhood response team for Portland police down here at Central Precinct posted the eviction notice warning people that they would be kicked out around 7:30 this morning. Officers didn't show up until 9 o'clock this morning. Most people did leave. There were no arrests, but if anyone comes back between the hours of 7 a.m. and 11 o'clock, that could change. Meanwhile, Carlos says that this is not like the homeless camps downtown and that he thinks that they should be given a break. I think for the majority of part about it is, you know, when you're homeless out here on the street, you don't do drugs, you don't drink, that you know, there's a lot of misunderstandings. Uh, well, Portland police tell me that they did collect some of the belongings down here, including some bicycles and some blankets. Those are considered valuable items that were not collected or not moved here. They are going to store those at a nearby building, and anyone here down at this location who believes that that is their property, they can simply go collect it from Portland police. Reporting live downtown, I'm Brent Weisberg, Coin 6 News. Brent, thank you. Well, in a developing story, the